So let's talk about a useful reaction of diazonium um, ions. And this is a reaction that I will acknowledge is kind of a niche reaction. It actually follows more use in terms of color chemistry and textile color chemistry. But it's still something to be aware of, particularly as you start going forward in your chemistry career. And the thing is that if we have a diazonium salt like this, and this is something we've talked about making in a previous video, this is actually very reactive towards benzene. And if we do have some type of benzene complex, what we'll get is nucleophilic attack of the benzene ring onto this group. Now, once we get this reaction, we're going to end up dehydrogenating. And what we'll end up producing when we're done is this complex here. So, what happens with these types of reactions is that we end up getting the N2 plus group on the alkyl azide or the diazonium ion to react with the benzene. This reaction allows us to actually form a carbon nitrogen bond and ends up doing what we call um, coupling reactions. So, again, kind of a short, simple reaction, very niche, but this is a reaction that does occur spontaneously and can be used to bind our R groups to something like a benzene ring through this dinitrogen bond.